Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button and join the family. And if you're a returning subscriber, what's poppin'? Thank you guys so, so much for joining me for today's video. As you guys seen by the title, you guys, today I'm going to be reviewing Full Shine Halo hair extension. And you guys, real quick, um, this is not the first time that I've reviewed Full Shine's hair extension. I've actually reviewed Full Shine hair extensions a couple times on my channel. So if you want to go ahead and watch those videos, go ahead and check out my description. I'm going to go ahead and link those videos down below. Um, I've tried out their clip-ins. Their clip-ins and their tape-ins, you guys. So today we're going to be reviewing their Halo hair extensions. Are they a hit or are they a miss? Anyways, without further ado, let's go ahead and just get right into this video. Oh, I just need you to know I'm always stay a blue strip. Keep the shit on honey. Yeah, cause loyalty don't cost nothing. I'ma hold it down, girl. I hope that's worth something. Yeah. All right, you guys. As I mentioned, today I'm going to be reviewing Full Shine's Halo hair extensions, you guys, these are 100% human hair. Um, and this is how their packaging looks. It seems like they still have the same packaging, which is, it's cool. I love, I love the vibes. I love the nude vibes. I think their packaging is super cute and simple. I love it. Alright, you guys, so it comes with, oh, they changed their little... Um, little pamphlet. This is so cute. It says full shine. Oh, you guys, if you are not new here, you know that I literally am all about packaging and like little quotes and stuff. I really love that their little like little book thingy, their little pamphlet um, has a cute little quote. It says, you do not have to be perfect. Just be yourself. I think that is so cute. I love that. But anyways, you guys on here, you do get all of their social medias and they also have little warm tips for you guys using their hair extensions, which is always a good thing because not a lot of us know how to properly care for, um, our hair extensions. And I also believe that every hair extension company does manufacture their hair extensions differently. So I would totally just take a look at that, you know, and you know, take care of them. <laughs> but anyways, you guys, this is how it comes. Oh, I just dropped something. You guys, so here is um, what the extensions actually come in. Just a little, simple little plastic. And you just open it. Ooh. It comes in a little net and they send you Oh, okay here it looks like here is the fish wire or the little like plastic wire and then replacement clips I think or they're probably the clips let's see all right you guys so this is how it looks um I believe I got 22 inches if I'm wrong I'll correct it and I'll like put something right here for you guys but this is their halo clip-in hair extensions in 22 inches um let me grab some scissors to show you guys. I'm going to just cut this right here. And I love that these don't have any type of scent to them. You know, like sometimes hair extensions have like this like really nasty scent. Like, I don't know. But it has no factory scent to it. Um, I super super love it. I believe these are 80 grams if I'm not mistaken. Um, so they're probably not going to be like super full if you, if you have like bulky hair or like if you have a lot of hair or a blunt cut, I would probably suggest you getting, um, either like seeing on their website if they have anything with like a higher volume like higher grams um but yeah this is just 80 grams so i think if you already have like layered hair i think it should just work out better because i feel like that'll help it blend if that makes sense um but you guys, this is how it comes. Here is the little wire that is going to go around your crown area. 
and then this is how the weft looks and then ah, you guys I actually chose these hair extensions because I seen online that these are your typical like halo hair extensions like you can wear it like this except I feel like it might not be as secure so I would definitely definitely um grab these that have the clips because the clips are going to grip onto your hair and just help them stay better and not move um yeah it's just gonna help it stay better and just not move on your on your head so like if you're dancing or anything like that or like you're out and about you can live your best life worry free you know what i'm saying <laughs> but here are the little clips that it comes with these clips right here actually have some type of grip in the back I don't know if you can see the detail to that, but you actually just pop these on where you want them. So here's the clip, and then I'm just going to go ahead and pop it, I think, right here. This is so freaking cool, you guys. Like, oh, and it actually stays. Like, oh my god, that's literally super secure in there. I'm so excited. I've never like, what? Like who came up with this? This is genius. Especially because you can move them around. Well, I hope it actually doesn't pop off, you know? Like if it doesn't pop off, y'all killed it. <laughs> you guys did an amazing job. But I love that because you can basically place, th place these wherever you feel like you need to place them, which I think is freaking genius. Um, but I literally am already loving it. I love the feel of the hair. I did get these in a jet black, so I don't have to dye these hair extensions. However, you guys, these are 100% human hair. So if you need to dye these, you definitely can dye them. Um, and, like, if you guys were getting, like, little tip, if you guys are getting hair extensions and you have blonde hair or lighter brown hair, I would suggest either trying to match it to the closest one or always, um, I actually learned this from them, from one of the companies that I worked with um, but I would suggest that you always get a shade lighter just because um, you can definitely tone the hair down no matter what shade it is um, it's always harder to to bring up a shade with hair extensions just if that makes sense um, just because these aren't attached to our own natural scalp so there there's no way that like you can actually just bleach them and have and expect like super healthy hair quality after that because again you guys these aren't attached to our scalp so there's no actual like natural oils you know that are helping the hair or anything like that so i would honestly just when in doubt go a shade lighter <laughs> because again you can always go a shade darker or you can always tone them down to match your shade um yeah i think it's just healthier for the hair i really really love them and i'm so excited to try these on anyways you guys enough of me rambling let's go ahead and try these on okay guys so i have my little clip i'm going to go ahead and just suction my hair and i'm just literally going to be doing the crown area I kind of sectioned it really low let me see I might pull it up depending how it looks but this is how I'm going to be sectioning it all right you guys so now that I've sectioned my hair um, you basically just want to make sure that you have your section literally like at the same spot just because that's where the fish wire is going to um, be applied first. I'm going to show you guys how the back looks. So it's literally not perfect, you guys. I don't even know how that looks, but I'm going to show you guys how I apply it. So first, I'm going to go ahead and do the fish wire. And you guys, I have a mirror right here, so that's why I'm going to be looking that way. Um, uh. 
Okay, so I think it's right there. And then I'm going to just clip the clip where I have it. I think that feels good. I'm gonna go ahead and let my hair down. And I'm going to go ahead and comb my hair. Where is my brush? All right, you guys, so this is how they look. Oh my God, I literally am so obsessed, you guys. Like. Honestly, the first time I ever tried hair extensions, I kid you not, I feel like it's the best form of hair. Just because of the fact that you cannot see the hair extension, it does not feel super bulky. And you guys, I literally just love how quick and easy it was to put that on. So like if you have an event to go to and you're running late or anything that you just want to do to get a quick hairstyle, like... Halo hair extensions is the way to go and especially the ones that have the clip in the back like this one um, I would totally recommend because it just stays put like you can be living your best life you know shaking your head back and forth and it literally does not move it just stays there if you do have more hair like a lot of hair I would probably recommend you using this as a like volume weft or something besides your hair extensions um, but yeah, anyways, you guys, I super, super love them. I'm going to go ahead and do a little curl chest to see, to show you guys how these curl. You guys already know that on my channel, we always got to do the heat test. No matter what hair extensions they are, no matter what brand, no matter if it's the same brand, you never know. Did they change the quality? Did they up their game? What happened? you know it's been a minute let's check it out so you guys i'm actually going to go ahead and just curl them and then show you guys how they look okay so i'm done styling my hair you guys they definitely passed the heat test so sis go and grab some because they're one they're super quick and easy to just install super like i literally did this i literally curled my hair in like three minutes that's freaking crazy you guys and i can tell you guys that because i only played mommy by carol g and that's all it took for me to finish my hair <laughs> anyways you guys that might be because i literally have super short hair and like not even a lot anyways you guys i super super recommend these hair extensions they literally feel super good i literally can run my fingers through them even though i've just curled them i know a lot of them tend to feel super like nasty after you've curled them even though they supposedly are 100 human hair but these actually never fail full shine it just never fails to amaze me i super love their products you guys their hair quality is literally just so amazing and if you've never tried halo hair extensions sis this is your sign to go get some like, if you have a lot of hair um i don't see why you can't probably buy two halo hair extensions and probably just layer one in the back and one towards the front because you honestly can't even see them they're so seamless and they're super lightweight feeling i definitely definitely recommend i'll go ahead and link down the hair extensions that i'm using for today's video you guys thank you guys so so much for watching my camera is dying if you have any questions or if you want to comment anything if you want to just say hi make sure to comment down on the comment section below i love to talk to you guys thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys really enjoyed this video make sure to hit the subscribe button if you were new here and turn on your post notifications so that you're notified every single time that i upload a new video and i'll see you guys on my next one bye